Well, my life is no longer on hold. That's right. I know what's going on. Well, I got in the mail. Results to the test. And, well, she lied to me. Or, I was the second man to test, or I'm not. I wasn't the only man to be tested, or I don't know. I don't know if I'm on the birth certificate. I don't know that, but uh, I'm the father of an almost 17-year-old son. So looks like we have another Myers in the family. Good news. It's now not it's not la it's not a lie. It's now the truth. Time to move forward. And if he wants to come live with me, be a part of my life. Cool. Pack your bags, son. So again, let me recap. I am the father, the flesh father, of one Christopher Myers. Well, at least she didn't name him Michael. I'd like to know who she's named after, or who he is named after. But, uh... Yep, one Christopher Myers is my son. Now my life is not on hold. Time to move forward. And if he wants to be a part of that moving forward, pack your bags, son. For all the people out there that were giving me support, emails, my real life friends, my YouTube friends, and little peeps. Yeah, well, the truth came out, and that's all I wanted. I would have been upset if I wasn't the father, or the flesh father. I don't know, would be, and I was going to be upset if I was the flesh father. For the simple fact of the deceit, the betrayal, the lies, the criminality of her actions... But got some things to do, and that, and to anybody that's ever hurt, if anybody's ever hurt that child in any way, shape, or form, or put their hands on that child, it might just have been the last thing you've done. Peace.